<laughs> yeah, keep going straight. It is so nice out, you guys. It's Feb. It's like mid-February, February 20th. And it is like 61 degrees outside. So we are out on a little walk. So we are loving this weather. We've been playing outside. I've been raking because we have all these like stickly, sticky things that came off or prickly things that came off our trees. So I've been raking a little bit. Avery's been chilling on the blanket. Anyway, yeah, so it's just like a really beautiful day. Um, but I wanted to talk. I took a short little clip. I'll input that here. We just got back from the dentist. Uh, Grayson had a dentist appointment today and they took x-rays and I knew they were gonna find something. For some reason, he just has really bad teeth. I think he has my bad teeth. Anthony's like never gotten a cavity. I have, t I've gotten tons of them. My dad has really bad teeth. So anyway, yeah, he's got bad teeth. He's already had a cavity once, or maybe it was a couple. I think it was just once. Anyway, he has another cavity, the exact same spot he had it the time before. And the time before they were able to just get it like with a laser with filling. This time they said because it's in the same place, they can't do the filling again and they have to do a crown on his tooth. Which I'm just like, oh my gosh, like a five-year-old and he has a crown? All right. So we're going back in May. That was the earliest they had, which is kind of crazy as well. And we have to pay like $200 and get him a crown. So that stinks. Hopefully Porter and Avery have better teeth than Grayson because that's expensive. And he's just going to lose it. He's already lost two teeth. He lost another tooth. Um, it was the day before Valentine's Day, but I mean, geez, I'm protecting these teeth that he's just going to end up losing. They did tell me that he's going to start getting molars, like they call it the six-year-old molars in the back of his mouth, so I didn't know that was a thing. So I guess I'll be on the lookout for that, but yeah, not the best news from the dentist, but I guess it could have been worse, could have been better. There was a little girl there though, and she was just crying and having a fit did not want the dentist to touch her i was like girl i feel you i hate the dentist but anyway we're just on our walk and about to go make dinner so yeah i hope you guys are enjoying your spring-ish day avery <gasps> hi you say hi and i've got felix on my lap We're just having our morning cereal. Well, it's like oatmeal. Avery does pretty well with it. Huh? Is that yummy? It tastes so good. I love this stuff. And then I've got the boys here. And they're watching Disney sing-along songs. So their new obsession. <clears throat> Did you guys have this VHS? at home well probably not this one this is disneyland paris which didn't even know that existed but when i was growing up we had the disneyland sing-along song vhs and we actually used to like put it in the car and like listen to it as we drove around town a couple months ago i put it on for my kids because grayson's super into disney we went about a year ago and i was like oh look at this really cool song this is what i loved as a kid and grayson is just hooked Porter will watch it okay, but he gets kind of tired of it because it's just the same video over and over again, but Grayson just loves it, absolutely loves it. So we've been watching a lot of that this week. We've gotten back on the hook. I am vlogging because we have gotten, I want to say this is our third snowstorm. <clears throat> For some reason, the past two Saturdays, we've just gotten dumped with snow. Yeah, it was like raining all last night, and then about... I don't know, 3 a.m. I think it turned to snow and it's been snowing ever since. Although I think it stopped. I think it's done and that's it. That's all the snow we're gonna get. And like tomorrow it's supposed to be like low 50s and then the next day like 60 and then like 65. So it's all gonna melt. So it's just like super random. We just got a bunch of snow dumped on us. So the kids are pumped. They wanna go play in the snow. Also what is happening today well, before I tell you, let me show you the snow in case you're like interested. So here's the snow. It's not as much as last time, but it's still pretty significant. I think it said like two to three inches is what we got. But you can see the road, like they've been like paving it or whatever it is, the snow plowing it and it's fine. 
um, but it's definitely stuck to like grass and things like that. But like you can see like the ground. So it's not that much snow, but it's still a good dusting. Anyway, getting back to what I was talking about before, today is an exciting day and I'm hoping to vlog a bit of it because my youngest sister is going to get engaged today. She's been dating her boyfriend about a year and a half now. And a little bit ago, he came to all of us and said that he wants to propose to her. So he got the ring and he's got it all planned out and wants to do it now, which I was like, February, <laughs> it can be kind of cold and he wants to do it outside. So hopefully this is what he was envisioning a snowy proposal because that's what it is. So he's going to go um, and propose at a park. I think it has significance to them. Um, it's in downtown Columbus. It's either like where they had their first date or where he asked her to be his girlfriend. I don't remember. It has significance. So we're going to go. My sister and I are actually going to go. He hired a photographer. Sorry, Avery's getting kind of grumpy. He hired a photographer to take pictures of the whole proposal, which is super romantic. So Allison and I are going to go early and meet this photographer so that we can like point out who they are so she can like figure out who to take pictures of, I guess. <laughs> Although I don't think there's going to be a lot of people in this park because it's cold. I think the high of today is like 34 and it's like snowy, but maybe, maybe there'll be a lot of people. So we're going to go, he's going to propose, and then there's going to actually be an after party at a restaurant that again has like significance i think it's like where they had their first date i think he like rented out a private room at this restaurant and the whole family is going to be there i think some of his family is going to be there as well and some of their friends and we're all just going to celebrate them with some like appetizers and i think it's like an open bar so anthony's going to come with the kids to that i'm not going to bring the kids to the engagement obviously they would like give blow our cover so anyway, very exciting. Um, we're going to have another engagement. Right now, my youngest brother is engaged to his fiance, and they're getting married May of next year. So it's a little over a year away. So it'll be interesting to see when my sister and her soon-to-be fiance will want to get married. But lots of weddings coming up. I also have like two cousins that are wanting to get married next summer too. And yeah, it's just a lot of weddings lately, I guess. So very exciting so i hope to be able to take a video of the proposal if i'm like close enough hopefully um i'm not very familiar with this park so hopefully there's a place that we can like hide behind and my sister is telling me like we should wear hats to like disguise ourselves i don't know it's it'll be interesting so we'll see but yeah it's it's super exciting she's gonna be so pumped to be engaged she's been wanting her a uh, boyfriend to propose for a while now and finally he's gonna do it so <clears throat> my kids are gonna have another uncle and i'm gonna have another brother-in-law and super super exciting i'm just hanging out with the kids right now letting anthony sleep in we've kind of got this like schedule going on where anthony sleeps in on saturdays and i get to sleep in on sundays so avery's getting kind of tired of this cereal i think she's at her wit's end are you all done are you all done She's smiling like, yes, I'm all done. All done. Are you all done? All done? All done? She gets it all over her face, huh? Are you all done? I've been teaching her, like, sign language, so all done is just shaking your hands like this. I think she understands it. And she definitely understands where's Dada. Because I'll say, where's Dada? And she will look and find Anthony. But then Anthony says, where's Mama? And she doesn't look for me. Huh. And she knows tap, tap, tap. Oh. We've been teaching her high five. Tap, tap, tap. Yeah, good girl. So, little tricks here and there. Uh, yeah. Uh. Are you a done? A done? Okay, I think she's all done. So anyway, yeah, I will vlog a little bit, maybe at the proposal, maybe at the after party too. Um, only problem with this after party is it's right during Avery's nap. <laughs> So we'll see. I'm hoping she's not too grumpy. We'll see. Yeah, my kids are super excited and <clears throat> it'll be fun. So anyway, um, I'm just kind of rambling. Other than that, we don't have too much going on other than another snowstorm. So 
Um, yeah, I'll pull out the camera in a little bit. I made it. We're waiting. <laughs> We're behind a tree. <laughs> They're gonna do it. Over in that white gazebo. The photographer's waiting. It's very cold. <laughs> We're freezing. <laughs> Okay, hopefully it goes well. I don't see them. Oh, I see him. He's kissing. Oh, he's going to get He's doing it. He's doing it. Go, go, go. I think it's close enough. Oh. Oh, she's kissing him. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Okay, Megan's totally seen. Oh, she's just chilling. <laughs> Shot. Yes. <laughs> they're so natural. Uh, they're, they are. Yeah, you look so like models. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, 